within that, you can start to love people more. You can start to appreciate people more. You can start to accept people more. September 28th, 2018. And I just, I'm feeling really good right now. Specifically, I'm just feeling very grateful. And even more specific than that, I'm feeling grateful for the people in my life. It is so much about the people, it's not even funny. Like, we're all on these big journeys and it can be easy to get caught up in the in the stuff and in the results and in the end game and not appreciate the now and the journey and the process of everything that's going into it. And part of that, part of appreciating the journey I find is really em embracing and appreciating the people that we're spending this journey with. They're, at least for me, what I've found is like stuff and results are not actually that enjoyable. What is enjoyable is the people I am spending it with, the that and the actual process of the journey because it's just so enjoyable on a day-to-day -day basis rather than the actual result. But the point I'm trying to get across here is how important the people aspect of it is because if we you could have a hundred billion dollars but if you don't if you aren't surrounded by people that you love and care for and you just feel a sense of um whether that's resentment grief all types of negative feelings and just like you are lacking in the relationships department that is going to that, like all the money in the world will not make you happy in that scenario. It is so much about the people. It's not even funny. Like, and I know I just said that, but I guess I'm just repeating myself. But like, it, people dictate your quality of life so much. And even, I, I remember, I think it was, it was in 20, yeah, early 2017, I like distanced myself from like everyone. And it was interesting and I'm glad I did that. But I wouldn't do that again, I don't think, um, or at least anytime soon, because I'm, I enjoy, I'm learning to love people more. I am, it like, I think it really comes down to judgment, by the way. The less you judge others, the less you judge yourself. And within that, you can start to love people more. You can start to appreciate people more. You can start to accept people more um, because you're going to pretty much project everything your pro everything you're like thinking and feeling about yourself kind of just ends up projecting on a, on the outside world. So when you become less judgmental and more self loving and more um, more self respecting and accepting, and I think I already said that, but whatever, all of this shit, you start to project that on the world as well, and it ends up creating way better relationships. And I absolutely do think you should be incredibly discriminatory with who you surround yourself with because you're absolutely the average of your five best friends, um, quote unquote. So basically, whoever you surround yourself with the most, you will become. And it's so important to surround yourself with people who are going to make you grow, people who have learning mindsets, um, who are in it to learn themselves and then also help you learn um, people that you can rise to the top with, people that level you up, um, people that support you in authentic ways and not just like yes men, but more like they can be challenging, but also kind and supporting at the same time. Of course, kindness and of course, support. And it's just very crucial the way that you, like there's like a fine line right there that really makes the, the difference and it's important to have that. Um, interesting people, people that are just like totally different than you. I think that's super interesting as well. Like to have those people around, it creates very interesting discussion. That's another thing. Having in, having fascinating discussions, people that are open to new ideas, people that are, yeah, just these kind of things. What else can I say? For sure, 
it just is it just is the variable like we go through these journeys you have to surround yourself with people that you love and people that love you and of course and that that's also the thing with that love is a one-way street like true love that is it's about like because if you love just just for the sake of getting love back that is not actually true love that is an attachment thing right there and it should probably be looked at but like just loving for the sake of loving people usually do love you back and i mean i guess that kind of is part of the side intention with it all is just to like share love with people and i have no idea where this is going but <laughs> so i'm gonna cut this off here but it's so fucking important to be cautious of who you surround yourself with and surround yourself with people that you love surround yourself with people that raise the quality of your life not take away it's very 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 important because it absolutely dictates your happiness my name is josh moxie and i will catch you later